After a year of joining Action SA, Bongan Baloyi has left. He was set to lead the party towards the 2024 elections as a provincial head. He details his reasons for leaving the political organization. I think the, the big moment for me was in various people who are saying to me, stay and fight, let's democratize the party, let's do this, let's do this. I can't be a person who's going to be part of the destruction of Action SA and create another cope. It is important for young people to start seeing different examples of leaders who thrive, who aren't as patient, who are agitated just like them. Because to change the political system will require young people to do that. Young people who will not sit in the corner and be told, and just be happy with national spokesperson. I am not that generation. I don't represent that generation. However, Action SA maintains that irreconcilable differences between him and the party were the reason. While it is evident that irreconcilable differences exist between Beloy and Action SA's national leadership, these issues relate to differences arising from the running of the Gauteng province. Various media reports over the weekend are noted for conveying a number of inaccuracies on this matter. At the previous meeting on 6 March 2023, Mashaba made the offer to Beloy for him to take up the mantle of national spokesperson, a senior national position within Action SA, which is automatically represented on the Senate, Action SA's highest decision-making body. Today, at the meeting of 13 March, Beloy declined this offer. Baloy has also disputed claims that the fallout with Mashaba was as a result over whether the party should work with the ANC. Mashaba has been vocal about his unwillingness to engage in talks with the ANC with regards to coalition agreements, but Baloyi says behind the scenes the party leader endorsed the engagements with the governing party. That's how this ANC thing comes. That's how people are lying that my main difference with Dr. Mashaba is about working with the ANC. It is a lie. He endorsed engaging with them. He gave us support. He was happy that we'd be able to co-govern uh, either in executive only and there in, 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 in legislature. That was what he consented and supported and gave us the mandate to go and do. So unfortunately, in media, then there's a thinking that it's Bongani and I'm upset about that. And I've moved from there because I started to see that hey, some things here, yeah, you must navigate tricky. Uh, so when the party leader starts to move left, hey, you must just uh, stay clear. Baloyi has urged the party to work out its internal weaknesses. Baloyi says he does not regret leaving Action SA. However, at this point, he's weighing his options. Natasha Piri, SABC News, Johannesburg.